you. Hey, welcome back. Today, I'm here at a friend's garage with Harold and this guy, Jack. I'll remember his name one day. These are my, my club brothers. And we're going to install the new affordable, i.e. cheap, splitter that I just got for under 100 bucks. Um, we got the car all loaded up on the ramp. Things are looking good. Right, here it is, the unwrapping. Look at the finish on that thing. Look at that. See, good looking stuff for the price, right? I'll have a link down in the description so you can go and get your own. You know you're going to want it. It came with no instructions, but it came with uh, all the hardware, hopefully. There's the middle. You have to figure this out like a puzzle. It's actually came with five pieces. Five? Yeah, so this is the end piece. Oh, okay. Alright, it's got little, little tabs here that gotta go in these holes here. Now I saw a video, you got to be careful with these, putting this together. If you do it too tight, it'll pull it in and dimple it along here. You don't want that. That's that. Okay. Let's turn this over. And Harold's already got the other split off. Okay, I've got several size little screws here. Making these go into here. Being kind of gentle on this because I don't want to dimple the top side I'm making it too tight no dimples all right it's not like me to do a good job I'm when I was a Honda mechanic they called me the destroyer because I broke shit all the time it's got these here going here yeah go up in here there we go okay. yeah. and then you screw these through here Right. But if you do these too tight, it pulls the plastic in. Right. Creates dimples on the top side. And all those ones that came out are, are good to reuse, Harold? Yep. Okay, good. Yeah. yeah, sometimes you don't know about this inexpensive Chinese products. And we'll, we'll be back in a few weeks to do my... Uh, my side skirts. Who, who is this coming from? Who is this from? Off of Amazon. So are these carbon fiber? No, that's ABS wrappers. Okay. A lot bigger when you're standing next to it. Isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I hit a curb. I didn't do any shows till I got here. I know. Sure, I know, yeah. I know. All them kids you let in and out of your car, they ain't gonna... Hey, tell them. <laughs> you <laughs> That's what David does. Well, I understood the music. There you go. You understood the car. I understood the car. I understood the car. I understood the car. I understood
Wow. And they wouldn't let that, that stuffed bear vote, huh? Did you count your chicks? I didn't touch the chicks. Did you look at them? See, I think I would have done better. Hey, can you hold this on somebody there? You yeah. Good, man. I, I, I would have done better yes, at the uh, the Harley show. Nope, not these. No tiny. Oh. I would have done better at the Harley show, but I put my tickets, my ticket envelope. I didn't realize how that worked. You know, I never done a show before. Mm -hmm. So I had it inside the dash uh -huh. so where people couldn't reach it. And then I realized about halfway through, I put it outside. I bet you I missed the wrong tickets. Because them Harley guys, you know, that car is Harley colors. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good. Yeah. When David had money, he'd buy a hundred, a hundred and fifty dollars worth of fifty fifty tickets. You know he's always so he'd always win. He'd stuff them in there. <laughs> yeah. And he he'd always have the kids trapped it all the way in and out of his car yeah, all the time. Sure. I like trophies, but I don't like them that way. Well. Oh, I'm I'm selling Corvettes is what I'm doing. I mean, <laughs> them kids will be Corvette lovers for life now. Can we pull another for you? Yeah, because I you do it too much in the dimples. Yeah, it will. Right, there it is, look at that. Look at that big old thing. All right. All right, we're ready to put that new one on. Let's see if we can get some footage of that. I should have brought my cameraman. Well, Swaggy Deal wanted to come and be the cameraman. Okay. One someplace. You missing one? Yeah. You gonna miss a hole? No. Why they got next one? Right. I have an extra screw. <laughs> Maybe there's uh, a hole there. Oh, extra parts. Looks like they're all there, right? Yeah. yeah. Hello, Dalwin. I think yours is longer than mine. It might be a little bit. Yours is pretty long. Mine's pretty long. Yeah. yeah. That one is long. <laughs> Jack, Jack you were <laughs> drinking again? I thought you gave up drinking, Jack. Four, five, six here. Six there. Mm -hmm. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. What did I say? 18. <laughs> <laughs> 1, 2, 3. I have 21 holes. So there's got to be 20 up there at least. Well, there's not. There's 19. 19, yeah. You lost one. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. This is 20. Right. So you got one less hole here. But you said you got 21 in that one. No. Yeah. 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 Twice. Yeah. One, two, three. Well, this is a little bit. We don't see where you missed one. It says it's loose somewhere along the line. You put it in. <laughs> <laughs> and there's no open hole, so. Yeah. Oh, there's two screws. Is it true left? <laughs> yeah. Okay. So that's, that's what we got. That's what we got. Okay. Now keep those. Yeah. That looks good, huh? Not this one. 
Yeah, double check the miner if you would. Did I leave my Phillips bed up here? Your what? My Phillips bed. Oh. All right, you did a good job, Harold. You're a good job. Good. Yeah. Okay. We're done. That took uh, 25 minutes. <laughs> We actually had a couple extra screws. We just took out the factory screws, put them back in. There's uh, three bolts on each side to hold this together. Three on each side that hold the, the side wing on. And it's done. I'm going to bring it down and get the heck out of here. Ooh. Stop right there. Stop. Looks like I put the ramps on. So there's that new affordable splitter. Okay, get yourself one. I'll have a link down in the description. 25 minute installation, $100 for the glossy black. I think it's like $89 for a matte black if you want to get it wrapped. That improves the look of the car. Well, she's done. Got me a new splitter. Needs a little cleanup, but this is how it looks. That really, really stands out. Money well spent, I'd say. All right, well, that's it. It only took us about 25 minutes from start to finish. Big thank you to Harold and Jack. Real good club brothers. They understand the meaning of brotherhood. All right here's Jack admiring his work. <laughs> All right. So, if you want to see any more videos with Boomer C8, I'll put it right up here. I'll put a little, little thingy up there for you. As usual, I'm Tim. See ya. <laughs>